The shots of the sunset you just saw were from an evening about a week ago, when I decided to bike out to the fields and simply do some photography. I didn't have anything specific in mind, I just wanted to practice my photography and have some fun outside. So golden hour was coming up and I packed my camera bag to go. I am about to go out and shoot during golden hour and sunset and today I'm testing out the newly bought GoPro to see how it works for behind the scenes stuff, trying to find the right settings, etc. Let's go. You got me falling. So here was my first stop. I wasn't even at the fields yet. To get to the fields, I need to bike through this short path in the forest, and on the way, this little area here caught my eye. Spring has fully started here in Austria, and the forest looked much greener than it did last time I was here. So first, I shot this photo here of the leaves. Then next I set the focus behind the leaves onto the trees with the leaves blurry in the foreground. And before continuing, I got some of the footage you saw at the beginning. So those were the first shots of the evening. I think they're okay, but really only okay. They're not in any way special or interesting, but you know, that's how it is. The first shots are usually not gonna be the photo of the day. I'll have to find something better later. So here, I've only just come out of the forest and arrived at the field and came across this car next to the path. <laughs> so, as you just saw, I actually got the shot and wanted to continue, but as I passed the car, I thought the angle from behind looked really cool as well, so I stopped again to get another shot. This is it. I like it too, but I prefer the previous two because they have the sunset in the background, which I think looks more interesting. Next, instead of getting back onto my bike, I checked what's around the corner and found these little branches also here. <laughs> I got a little low with the camera to capture the silhouette of these with the mountain and the sunset in the background. I really like the shot actually, it's again nothing special, but I like the colors and the overall mood of it. Here is also where I got one of the shots from the intro sequence. <laughs> you heard the sounds I just made there as I looked behind me. I don't know if you saw it, but the moon was out bright and some pink clouds were just above it, so I had to get that shot. 
I got the Lumix out of my bag because it had the 14 to 140mm on it, which zooms into an equivalent of 280mm on full frame, which I wanted to get that moon nice and big. Do you know that feeling when you've possibly just got the shot of the day? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, these are the shots of the day. I'm very satisfied with the outcome. The sunset colors, the minimalism, the fact that it's a photo of the moon alone is cool, so these are definitely the photos of the day. After getting some more footage, I continued my bike ride and came across this little shed on the field, which I thought was a cool subject to shoot. The shots I got are fine, they don't blow me away or anything, but they're alright. I like this guy's gradient. A couple hundred meters onwards, I found a spot which gave the moon a nice frame with the trees, which I thought was quite cool composition-wise. I like the shots, although I'm not sure about the light, it's just blue, but that's fine I suppose. Here, I'm setting up the tripod and the camera to shoot that clip of me getting onto my bike and riding off into the distance. I really like that shot, by the way. And that was the end of the evening. As you can see in the footage, it was getting pretty dark and the GoPro was really struggling with the light. I biked on another 30 minutes approximately, but I didn't shoot anything anymore. So that's it with this little behind the scenes video of a photography evening of mine. I hope you enjoyed it, this video is the first of its type on my channel. I only just got the GoPro a few days before I went on that shoot. I really hope you enjoyed this kind of content because I really enjoyed making it and I would love to make more. If you have any feedback on your mind, please let me know in the comments. While editing this video, I had a lot of questions and doubts. I mean, it begins with the video quality of the GoPro. It's not really up to the standard I like to keep on this channel, but in this case I think it's a great tool to showcase the process of being out shooting. I also wasn't really sure if I should include the voiceover with my explanation and thoughts on the photos. Also the music was a point I wasn't entirely confident about. So as said, if you have any thoughts about this format I'm trying, please let me know. With that said, if you enjoyed it, leave a like, it helps me out, and if you haven't yet, feel free to subscribe, and I'll hopefully see you again next week. Goodbye!